everybody. I'm so excited to meet you all. I just finished playing with my ball and cuddling my teddy. I think you should know how grateful I am for being rescued at just four weeks old. My sister's got dumped along with my mummy, who has been sadly mistreated. We thought she wasn't going to make it, but thanks to the helpful staff at Animal Life, Animal Life Lifeline, she pulled through. And now I get to see my mummy all the time, as we were both rescued by some wonderful people who love us to the moon and back. I can't wait to give my human mummy lots of licks later. She treats me like a princess, and I believe my nomination is dedicated to a special lady who is watching tonight, and I hope she enjoys the performance. And that lady is Jill Taylor from Animal Wealth, Wealthline. Wealthline. So give her a massive round of applause. <laughs> now, girls and boys, this latest girl is called Lila, but I've got a funny feeling she's not gonna come out unless we shout her name. And this includes everyone up there, so we're gonna shout Lila after three and hope she comes. One, two, three. <laughs> She's here, girls and boys. It's Lila. Lila was a rescue dog. And Lila has come to show you a few tricks. So, this is Lila's granddad and Lila's mummy. And the first trick that we're gonna show you is sit. And pull. Give her a clap. Now, with this performance, we're not only pointing out the, the importance of rescue dogs, but also pointing out that it's not always the breed, well, it isn't the breed, it's the owner. So we just want to point that out and point out the importance of Jill's job working for animal la la life. I'm struggling with this word, aren't I? Lifeline. There we go. So, ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, give it up for Lila. And 